Leslie Tao here. Welcome to my YouTube. This is a video I'm making my Tesla so I can take advantage of the AC and sort of quiet car park area. So bear with me. Yeah, it's quite, quite nice and quiet. So I'm just doing a little what's going on around me nothing much just park cars now this video i wanted to share with you so at the moment what i'm doing is i'm just sharing with you what happens on a daily basis um, in our business this video is specifically about if you have an airbnb listing could be a booking.com listing or any other listing that's that's listed on a, a platform that's hosting your advert and there's inaccuracies in that it could cost you money this is an example so we actually suffer last year due to our cleaning standards not being good enough especially with airbnb but it was all around um drops in our reviews which impacted our you know our bookings and algorithm as well so for airbnb they might not have seen what well, when you go on and you know look at quan trees apartments in cambridge you, they might not it might not have shown that many on the first couple of pages because the reviews weren't very good because the cleaning needed picking up so what we have done um, is that um, we just start, decided to start again because the previous reviews, because there was quite a few, quite a number of negative ones, were really dragging the whole portfolio down. So we started a new account, so started from scratch. And you know, it was a shame to lose some very, very good reviews because that was a, about because that was a, a battle of reviews. So it was over, you know, over a thousand reviews from memory for sure so it was, it was a shame to lose that but um, i'm really glad we did what we did because what happened was so what we did before we switched over to a new account was that we gave most of our properties a slight refurbishment a little paint and upgraded everything and also homed in on our cleaning is such a key cleaning and maintenance issues so in case you haven't seen my uh, previous videos on on the subject of what we're doing with our cleaning team to make sure we get more consistency and a better experience for guests do check out the video which i'll ask the editor to put like a link here to it okay so click on that and have a look at this video um, about what we're doing to maintain our cleaning standards or oh, i hope it's not too wobbly so bear with me guys because i'm sort of balancing this sort of stick that's holding my camera up on my wheel and it's not a flat surface so i'm hoping it, like this video won't be too wobbly so we were doing quite well so as you can see in june and july we got loads of five stars and some four stars as well then we got a one star and our one star wasn't even about our maintenance, you know, facilities. Well, to some extent, the facilities. So I'll explain that slightly. But it wasn't about the cleansiness of the property. It was literally because in our adverts that, so the new advert that we swapped over, VA who was handling this, but ultimately it's our fault because we didn't pick up on it until we got a bad review. She had clicked, she had put that there was parking at the premises and there is no parking on the premises. This is city centre Cambridge and it's so hard to get parking there. And unfortunately, but this guest was absolutely right because she needed access to parking because of um, accessibility reasons but it was good it was so good that she cancelled in the end because in any event this was a this was an apartment where she would need to have to climbed two flights of stairs to get there so i don't think that that would have been possible given her mobility issues so it's a good thing that she cancelled so i wanted to be honest to show you the bad review and then we also replied and thanked her for um telling us what the problem was so that we could rectify it for future guests but just one small one small mistake like that where someone's clicked that there is parking could lead to a loss of revenue now this lady only put for i think one or two nights so it wasn't too bad the loss but imagine if you had someone that but for a long longer period of time in our defense though a small defense is that we did put those two flights of stairs that she would have had to climb in the description so that was there but the mistakes small mistakes and attention to detail that wasn't there did cost us money so i wanted to tell you that you absolutely when you're listing your properties need to make sure you provide as much information as possible and also to be as accurate as possible in those listings otherwise it will cost you money so i hope that this is if this is a fairly short video but i just wanted to show you some of the the wins and the losses that we have on a daily basis and hopefully you can learn from my mistakes or our mistakes so have a lovely day and this is leslie town i'm checking out I'll see you in the next video. Bye.